What's up guys, it's your boys and Wokey back out with another Funko video and we're going to be looking at new Funkos that are going to be coming um, here shortly. It's going to be, I think, December and January. So we're going to be looking at these guys. So guys, grab a chair, grab some popcorn as we take a look at all these new Funko Pops and how you guys can get one for, or how you can get these pre-ordered right now. If you guys are new to my Zoloki channel, make sure you guys are subscribed down below by hitting that red bar icon down over here and then turn on notifications as well because when I do post videos like this one, you'll get that little ring notification that Zoloki's posted a video and then you guys can watch, like, comment, and share. And I surely do appreciate you guys subscribing, watching, and commenting. I really like reading your guys' comments and chatting and sort of like that on opinions, on pre-orders. I've helped a few people out when their fun goes and it definitely makes me feel happy that I can help out and kind of collab with you guys in getting your Funko Pops and sort of like that definitely makes me feel warm and fuzzy inside kind of helping you guys out but with that further for said we're gonna be looking at some new Funko Pops that are coming out in December and January um, a lot of them are gonna be ad icons as some we got some Disney ones um, we had some other kind of miscellaneous ones here and there we have Rock'em Sock'em Robots I'm super excited about those ones um, I'm looking on the website of pop in box I'll post that link down below for you guys to go on there as well and get your pre-orders in some of these like the ad icons some of them can be pretty rare when they sell out other pre-orders I don't know what it is about the ad icons but they go super fast and they're super rare when they do go out because they don't make them for some reason um, a lot of people like them I'm not quite sure I know Tony the Tiger people are uh, I, I remember last year for Black Friday, everybody was after this, like, I think it was Tony the Tiger or Captain Crunch, and everybody was freaking out about it because they needed to get it. It was like a Black Friday special. I don't know why, but um, we have some or we have some Coca-Cola ones, some Kool-Aid, um, but we're going to take a look at it right now. I'm going to pop or pull it up here, and we're going to take a look. Also, if you guys want to use the, the website, um, what is it called? PPG, which is prop or pop pricing guide so any of your Funko Pops like I have back here um, and all over there which you guys will see in the future um, when I do a room tour you can put these on your cat your your list or your website and you guys can categorize them on there for your value so it categorizes all your Funko Pops into a value of a lump sum of how much it is I think mine just hit like eight nine thousand dollars um, it shows you how many pops you are or have how what's your top ten most expensive pops it tells you your value of your pop if you ever want to buy or sell you can do it on that website it's definitely really good to use and it's free so i'll post that down below for you guys to use make sure you guys use it it's free and it's pretty fun to use and i like it too so with that being said here we go we're gonna pop it up here for you guys so starting off the bat we got some plushes on here um i'm not necessarily looking at the plushes you guys can see them right here i don't care about the plushes as much um, I don't think myself I'm going to get any of the ad icons just because I'm not a big ad icon Funko fan, but some of them are pretty cute. If you look at the Coca-Cola or the Kool-Aid, they're pretty, pretty cute. We talked about, I am going to talk about these a little bit faster. So if you guys do want to see these a little bit longer, just pause the video and you can definitely take a look. Um, but like we we talked about the Decepticons and the, the uh, Autobots in a later video. I'll post that link down below. We have Blade Runner. If you guys are Blade Runner fans, um, if you guys want to go to this website and click on it, it will tell you where your pre-order is. Um, it does give you a shipping cost as well, so they're not always free. Depending on, I've seen sometimes if you buy over, I think it's a forty dollar value, you get. Um, I think it is. I can't remember if you get a free shipping if it's forty or fifty dollars over. But you can pre-order it. It tells you your date or the the month. It doesn't give you an estimated exact date, but it tells you the month range. So, and I bought it from Pop in the Box, and they're pretty decent on their costs or their their prices and their pre-orders. They come pretty much almost within that month. Um, so moving on, we we have some more. Um, Transformers. We have WandaVision. I definitely forgot about that. We have the WandaVision, which is coming out this December on Disney+. Plus. I'm super excited about it because, one, it's coming out. I'm not quite sure why Wanda's pregnant in this one. Um, you can definitely see that she looks like she's... I want to say she's pregnant, um, but definitely going to be interesting to watch this on Disney+. Plus. I did hear some rumors as well that the Disney and Marvel are also thinking about putting Black Widow on Disney+, Plus as an exclusive... Um, movie premiere kind of like Mulan but I guess we'll see it when the future comes because they pushed it back till May and I'm hoping that they do the exclusive but with that being said let's move on we got some plushes we have the Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile that I think that's pretty cute because I've seen this thing in real life it's pretty cute we have more Blade Runner not a big Blade Runner fan I've never really got into it I know I'm probably gonna get hate for this but I never really got into it 
more ad icons of the the plush of the hostess donuts i mean they're pretty much bringing out any funko pops they can when it comes to i ad icons if you've pretty much eaten it it's probably out there with an ad icon so with that being said we have planters peanuts this one i've i grew up watching on car, or uh not cartoon network but i saw some ads and this guy was always there so we have some keychains i'm not a big fan when it comes to the keychains or keychain key chains holy crap but um, a lot of people do like them i have like three or four of them but if you guys like the cheek or <laughs> cheek canes key chains holy cow you guys can get those we have some more transformers i won't talk about any more of those we have bob's big boy restaurant um, i remember this on a, some type of movie i think it was a rocket boy i can't remember but it kind of resembles this um bob's big boy on funko town looking uh box so if you guys want to get that one it could be possibly rare we have the hawaiian punch punchy pop another ad icon we have WandaVision in her 50s version, which is kind of cool. She is all black and white. I mean, it's definitely because she's in the 50s and that's what they had for the TV. But moving on, we have some more plushes. We have Hostess in the Funko Forum. We have Spam. Why do they have Funko Spam? I'm not quite sure. But <laughs> moving on to that, we have Clue Miss Scarlet from Candlestick Funko. I have no idea who that's from. I could be... Um, Hopefully not upsetting anybody, but I've never seen that before. I have seen Masters of the Universe with the Skeletor, um, but that one will be coming here shortly. Uh, a lot of these, if you guys just click on the image, it'll tell you like your January, December. I'm not going to click on every single one, but um, we have Spam as a Funko Pop. I don't know why. I don't know why, but um, another one, uh, Clue. Oh, okay. Hello. Clue. This is the game, Clue. Holy crap. I can't remember... I can't believe I didn't think about it. The candlestick and then the, the lead pipe. Oh my gosh, this is from the game. Okay, never mind. This is from the game. Um, <laughs> we have Masters of the Universe keychains. Moving on to the next one, Masters of the Universe. Um, another ad icon, Slush Puppy. I remember seeing this dog on a lot of uh, billboards back, back when, when I was younger. We have uh, Mrs. White with the wrenched pipe. We have more keychains of Masters of the Universe. Uh, I'm going to kind of skim over these because I want this video to be too long for you guys. But I want you to know what is available for you guys to pre-order so you guys don't miss out on it. Some more clues. I'm not really into the, the Masters of the Universe or the Clue ones. Um, even the WandaVision, I don't necessarily think I'm going to be getting these ones. Um, but we have Vision, which is two different versions if you see the normal version. And then you have the Chase version, um, which this one is not necessarily going to be my favorite to get. Um, but, um, WandaVision is more in her comic book version. Um, I wonder if she's got a, uh, Chase version as well. I didn't see one, but, and then we have the comic book version of Vision. Uh, we have the Kool-Aid man with the, the plush. Um, I'm not a big fan when it comes to the plushes. Uh, so, uh, I mean, they just look like stuffed animals in Funko form. Uh, I'm not going to get any stuffed animals, so, um, we have always, it's always sun, sunny in Philadelphia. I never really got into that TV show. Um, so those are for you guys if you guys wanted to get any of those. Um, we did talk about the Starship Troopers in a different video. I wanted to talk about that a little bit more. One, because it's one of my favorite movies to watch. So I'll post that link down below for you guys to watch. Because I did talk about these in depth. We have Rocks Black Sabbath with Chase Funko Pop. I'm not quite sure why it's so big on the container if you guys could let me know down below in the comments why it's so big and, sh and like that is if it's uh an art piece in the back i'm not quite sure um next off we have dumb and dumber lloyd and the bicycle i'm super excited about the dumb and dumber ones because i grew up laughing so hard because jim carrey did a pretty good job and the other dude as well i love this movie i love the original i don't like the new one the dumb and dumber -er. i didn't like that one as much but um, if you guys want to get any of those, they are pre-ordered, or your pre-orders are right here. They do have Chase versions without a hat. Um, this one, guys, or this one has the wine glasses and he has the wine bottle. Uh, moving on to the next third page, we have Dumb and Dumber getting a haircut, and this one is um, different. It's not uh, Dumb and Dumber. Well, I don't know why they do it like this. Um, we have the Dumb and Dumber down here for the Lloyd getting his haircut with the bowl. <laughs> I, they make these things so much funny. I don't know. I, I get these uh, quirks and and funny gimmicks here. But And then we have BTV show Mike 
Donovan. Don't think I've ever seen that one, but you got the male per version up there and the female version down there. We have this one. I am super excited about the Harry with the Mutt's cut or cuts um, van Funko Pop ride with the the car. I'm glad that it's not the big car and it's like the smaller one. I'm super excited about that one. Um, and then we have obviously they have a lot of Dumb and Dumber. I didn't think they had this many, but yeah, they have a quite a bit of them. Um, next off it for another cartoon, we have Inspector Gadget. Do 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 do. I loved Inspector Gadget watching or waking up in the morning and watching Inspector Gadget. Definitely a fun. I watched the movies. Uh, they're definitely really good. I enjoyed them. So, um, Disney's Fantasia 80th Sorcerer Mickey Mouse. Uh, Mickey Mouse has like five or six different versions of M Mickey Mouse in this normal version, and then you have other versions where it's like he's. I'll show you guys. Um, we have another Star Wars clone. If you guys love the Star Wars, another one is coming out. Disney's Fantasia, the, the baby Pegasus. Um, we talked about the these McDonald ones a while back, not too long ago. I'll post that video down below as well. Um, Disney's Fantasia, the Menace, Cernanborg. I butchered that. Um, Sonic, I will definitely be getting that. Sonic 30th, um, just because I grew up playing Sonic on Sega, Sega Genesis. Uh, more, or another Sonic, um, the Hedgehog, the Silver Hedgehog, uh, more uh, Star Wars Pops, we got, looks like Darth Maul, and then Ashko, or Hosh so uh, Sokoa, oh, I butchered that, I'm sorry, but that, more Star Wars Pops right there, another Fantasia, the Hippo, um, I'm not even going to pronounce that, <laughs> Star Wars Pops, more Star Wars Pops, this one, Richard Simmons, I remember waking up in the morning watching him do his workouts and so forth like that. Just, I, it just brings back memories. I don't, I'm not getting in this one, but if you guys love Richard Simmons, this will definitely be up your alley. We're only on the fourth one. We're going to do this a little bit faster, but we have some more Fantasia 80th versions, like I told you, kind of like sparkly ones, paint ones, and so forth like that. Furby is going to get their own keychain when it comes to Funko Pops. I'm surprised they haven't made more. Um, Furbies have been really kind of scary when I grew up because they kind of glitched and talked weird and, and so forth like that. But more keychains when it comes to the Autobots and Decepticons. Um, I'm not quite sure. Critical Role, Vox, Machina, Pike, Trick, Foot, Holy Cow. That's a mouthful. I'm not sure about this one, if it's a movie, TV show, what have you. But let me know in the comments if you guys enjoy these guys with these Funko Pops where my finger is right now. We got Snoopy. I'm, I'm excited about this one just because I grew up watching Snoopy as well. Um, kind of like uh, Halloween Snoopy or what was it? The, the pumpkin that could. No, it's not the pumpkin that could. I can't remember the Halloween one, but I remember that one. The Christmas one and the Beagles and stuff like that. Um, I'm definitely excited about that one. We have 007 James Bond. Uh, another Funko Pop. I didn't really get into the James Bonds. I did play the game on 64, but not too big into the movies and the videos and and so forth like that we have butters um looks like professor chaos a funko keychain so if you guys like the keychains there you go we talked about the teenage mutant ninja turtle pops that came out i'll post those link or that link down below as well for more in-depth on those ones um we have hasbro's popple with chase funk i don't even know what this one is this one is definitely a weird looking one but if you guys know what this is pre-order's right there Monopoly, they're doing a lot of board games nowadays. Uh, Monopoly is getting the jail um, version of the criminal or criminal Uncle Penny Bangs uh, in that form of the keychain. We have a lot of Funko Pops when it comes to NFL. Um, ones that have no helmets, ones that do have helmets. There's a lot on here, so make sure you guys get those bin. I'm seeing a few of them getting sold out pretty fast. Um, so make sure you guys get those pre-orders in. How I Met Your Mother, Barney in his suit. When is he not in his suit when you watch How I Met Your Mother? Um, but if you guys like How I Met Your Mother, you can get Barney as a Funko Pop. Um, holy crap, people are trying to send me emails and Twitch notifications. We did talk about a lot of the Funko Pops when it comes to the new South Park ones. I'll, lo I'll post that link down below for you guys as well. Holy cow, we have The Office. Um, some Funko Pops. We have another Office keychain. Um... The Boys, Starlight with the Glow Chase. I'm not sure about that one. Oh, The Boys. Okay, that TV show. I just started getting into seeing some clips from this. I might start watching this. I'm not quite sure. Um, let me know if you guys watch The Boys. If it's any good, let me know down in the comments. Um, but moving on from there, we have some type of... 
Paka Paka. I'm not even sure what those are. Um, Critical Role, Critical or James Bond. This one right here, I'm super excited about the blue um, Rock'em Sack'em Robot. They have the blue version and the red version, and then they have keychain versions. I think I will be getting the blue and red ones because just because I grew up playing that one as well. Some more NFL Legend Vince and Packers. If you guys know this Funko Pop, go ahead and pre-order. Uh, <laughs> How I Met Your Mother with Ted. Um, I definitely think this is funny because the blue trombone, if you guys watch the TV show, you'll definitely know what that means. Um, the Office, Jan, Office, Kevin. These, this video is also just letting you guys know what is pre-order so you guys can pre-order them so as well. Um, more of the, the South Park I talked about before. The Boys, Queen Maeve. Uh, I, I think I need to get start watching that TV show. It definitely looks pretty good. Um, we have a Critical Role, James Bond, South Park, um, Teenage Mutant Ninja, Ninja Turtle that we talked about again. Oh, we got Kyle. And then we have Sock'em Rob, Sock Rock, or Sock, Rock'em Sock'em Robots, the red version. More NFL. We have Hasbro's Operation Game. This Mr. T. Okay, I was going to say, this looks like Mr. T. There you go. And then we have The Rock Dwayne Johnson as a Funko Pop in the WWE. So we have some wrestling pops. Um, office again. The boys again. I remember watching this guy protecting that woman's son that accidentally got killed in a clip. I think I remember that. The boys. It looks like this guy runs fast. I'm not quite sure. Um, then we have um, Critical Role, Vox Machina, Grog, Strong John, Funko Pop, um, more of the James Bond, South Park, um, then we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles that we've talked before, Office, um, we have a preview of the Hulk Professor, an exclusive Funko Pop for PX um, in a 6 inch version, we have some miniatures, we have some cat, we have Casper, the friendly ghost, the boys, Translucent Funko Pop, we have the boys, Eugene, um, Critical Role, I'm rolling on 6 here, holy cow, Critical Roles, we have, um, more South Park. We have Michelangelo, or not Raphael. And we have Monopoly crim or Criminal Uncle Pennybags, the bigger one. More NFL, the off or the Office. Then we have the boys. I remember seeing this guy, the Homelander, um, as well. But he was covered in blood for some reason. Um, moving on, we have Dune Lady, Dune Baron. Never watched this, so please be easy on me. I didn't see these ones. Um, as well as that one or that one, but they have chase versions. So if you guys want to get the chase version, so when you order these ones, you're not necessarily going to get a chase, but you're a possibility of getting a chase. So you pre-order it, they will send it out. And if you do get a chase, yay. But if you don't, ah, oh, I mean, that's how they do it. So it kind of sucks. I've ordered from pop of the box before and I've ordered like a captain Marvel hoping I would get a chase. I didn't get a chase, but oh well, and that's how they do theirs. We have more Furbies. I can't get the Furby because they scared the crap out of me after my experience back when. More Halo. I definitely talked about these guys way back when. Um, their pre-orders, I think, got pushed back because they were going to come out in October and then they got pushed to November. So hopefully they don't get pushed anymore because I'm definitely going to get those. We have Elvis, the King of Rock. Um, definitely, if you guys love Elvis, he'll be coming out here with the Jailhouse Rock. Um, we also have the Hawaiian Elvis, the 1968 Comeback Elvis. So there's going to be a lot of Elvises, so make sure you guys get those. Disney's Soul Joe. I've never heard of this, so I'm not quite sure what this has to do with Disney. But maybe I'll have to look it up. Um, we have some more weird-looking Funko Pops. They're coming out with some Funko Pops I've never even heard about. Um, we have Barbie, or Star, Rockstar Barbie. Some weird-looking ones. We have another WWE, some more South Park. Mr. Potato Head. I thought they had a Mr. Potato Head a long time ago, but I could be wrong. We have another business Barbie, because Barbie has an outfit for every occasion. Another Baby Yoda and another version in, in, in the bag, apparently. I've seen this version, like, or seen this Baby Yoda in like 18 different versions. I could be over-exaggerating, but I've seen a lot of them. Um, some more uh, retro toys. I talked about those not too long ago when it comes to um, G.I. Joe and uh, Zartan and stuff like that when it comes to the um, classics. More, another Star Wars. More Star Wars. I remember these glow worms um, when we were growing up. I think my sister had a glow worm. Um, I think it was blue, I want to say. But I remember the glow worms. Uh, looks like it's glow in the dark. We have a Peaches and Cream Barbie. Okay. <laughs> another Operation Game retro, retro toy. We have Dragon Ball Z. 
So if you guys like Dragon Ball Z, I'm not quite sure who this is. Evil Boo? Boo you? I could be butchering that. On more Dragon Ball Zs. I did talk about some Dragon Ball Zs not too long ago as well. I'll post that link down below for you guys to watch that video. Yep, I did talk about these guys. We have Peter Pan. Holy cow, Peter Pan's coming as well. More Ninja Turtles, Peter Pan, and Hook. Then we have Harry Potter writing a... <gasps> I don't even know what that is. Oh, writing, writing a dragon. We have Disney's 65 Mr. Toad with spinning eyes. I think I've seen this once. I can't remember. Um, it could have been uh, way back when. And then we have another Disney's um, Lederhosen. <laughs> the Office. Almost there, guys. We have some more Disney's with uh, Donald Duck. Uh, some cute, kind of cute ones here. Um, Simpsons on there. We have Iron Man. From, I'm surprised this one's still on here. I've seen people already getting this one. This one's October. Yep, so people should be getting that one already. So some of these are out. Not all of them. This is from newest to oldest, I think. Newest arrivals. Yeah, they're still, they're still technically newest arrivals. We have some plushes of Five Nights at Freddy. So if you guys like the Five Nights at Freddy. Disney's Castle with Funko Mini. That's pretty cool. Some a zombie bar, Bart. Um, some Halloween-y looking uh, Simpsons. We have that retro toy where you guys could used to pull on his arms and they would stretch and he was filled with like... This weird looking sand and stuff like that. I'm not quite sure what he was. Um, but more of the Marvels. Um, we have some more office ones. Um, we did talk about these guys not too long ago with the aliens. I'll post that link down below for you guys to take a look at the alien um, Funko Pops that came. Uh, I think it's a remix where these aliens come as other Pixar characters. And then last but not least, we have more of the aliens we talked about not too long ago. I'll post that link down below for you guys. We have Hulk as well. The Office, Michael Scott. Um, some Soljo, like I, I don't remember, like I said before. Um, some type of cat eating pizza. <laughs> See, these ones I've never seen before when it comes to Disney's Soul Grin. I've never seen these guys before, so this is new for me. More Office Pops, a lot of Office Pops. More Avengers. Um, we have Avengers Taskmaster, the Avengers Modoc, um, as well. We have a Dumbo writing mini as well. So there's a lot of Funko Pops here. Hopefully you guys didn't miss out on any of them that I talked about. If you guys do miss out on some of these and kind of, I wouldn't say got bored, but if you guys want to go back to this website, I'll post the link down below for you guys to take a look as well so it can help you guys get in those pre-orders as fast as possible so you guys don't miss out on them. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of some random Funko Pops that are coming December and January or December 2020 and January 2021. Hopefully the year of 2021 is going to be a lot better than 2020 cross our fingers hopefully you guys enjoyed this video hopefully you guys have a fantastic night keep it real keep it safe and we'll see you guys in the next videos and as always keep nerding on peace